Hey guys, what's up? And welcome to Will You Ever Return 2. It's not so much a second game, but like a continuation of the first. Uh, are you excited? Because I am. Alright, uh, let's go with new. I, I'm interested to see where he takes this because uh, the last one was definitely weird and beautiful. Part 2. Beta Blockers, Behemoth, and Blah. Is that you, Derek? Are you back now? Did you get me my medicine? My poor heart feels like it's been fibrillating for hours now. Don't worry, Mom. It's only me. Listen, I'm working to get your meds. I really am. But I just can't afford them right now. <laughs> His face looks so funny. It's okay, Pumpkin. I can live with these palpitations. Got me thinking, you know, all my life I've been waiting. What do you mean, waiting? Waiting for what, Mom? For this test to end. His heart breaks a little. Don't be like that, Ma. You're gonna be okay. Listen to me. You're gonna be okay. I'll do what needs to be done to get your bait blockers, okay? Thanks, Pumpkin. You're so good to me. I don't know what to do without you. I love you, Ma. I love you too, son. Oh. So... We're playing as the friggin' the bully guy from the last game. Am I really going to do this? Yes. Everything I've done in my life has brought me to this moment. And it comes down to this. Break what must be broken. That's all. Take the suffering on oneself. Truly great men must experience great sorrow on the earth. Pain and suffering are always inevitable. That's fucking deep, dude. Can I do this? Yeah. There's not to make a reply. There's not a reason why. There's but to do and die into the valley of death. But no man is innocent. This is not an evil. This is not an evil. This is not... This is not sleep we're talking about here. I ought to find a hiding place. Oh, it was him talking the whole time. What am I doing? This seemed like a good place to wait. Act up, you're mine. You know what the bud be done. You come someone now. It's that dude. Can I move now? I can. Hey, whoa! <laughs> it was hard. The power took over. The weapon felt right. The victim seemed appropriate, and Derek felt strong. So much blood, he thought. Five and a half liters looks like a lot when it's spilling across the pavement. Damn. He searched the body and found enough money to buy the beta blockers. <laughs> you found some cash! Yay! Time to go home. Okay. Let go. Oh no! <laughs> he got... Well, I can't say I wondered what happened to him before, but I know now. Are you done screaming? Okay, good. <laughs> Blinking fudge, where the heck am I? Did that car hit me? I don't like this one bit. Also, something smells like a naked man sitting on a turtle. Really? <laughs> naked man sitting on a turtle. What's up, plate dude? I be Azazello. Yes, man is mortal. But that would. What is this song? I fucking love it. The worst of it is that he's sometimes ex unexpectedly mortal. There's the trick. Want to save your game? Okay. So, I'm gonna need to stop this and try and get it into full screen. Because it's really small. Alright. We're back <laughs> in this place, 
Uh, I'm now in full screen, which is good. Which is awesome. Talk to this guy. Renounce life altogether. Accept fate. Obediently as it is. Once and for all. And stifle everything in yourself. Oh. What need have I for this? What need I have I for that? I'm dancing at the feet of my lord. All is bliss. All is bliss. I'm Virgil. I'm of no use to anyone whatsoever in this realm. Yon big cat over there can help you, though. But Virgil helped me last time. Alright. I loved my love because I knew my love loved me. And the moon is fat. So I'll give you that. Okay. In other realms of hell, I'm made to masquerade like a regular idiot, restricted to an eternity of mundanity. In this realm, I get to march back and forth. Oh, woe is me! Okay, now what? Can I get to the big cat? Okay. Okay. What about you? A skeleton. It's not gay if you make him cry. <laughs> Shit, I'm gonna use that in my daily life from now on. It's totally gumbo. And the moon is fat, I'll give you that. I called them strawberry smiles. The mortician called them signs of self-harm. Hi! Hi! Yo, yo, yo! What's going on, boy? I'm the fable behemoth of lore. That's kind of a little bit Irish. <laughs> Welcome to Oblivion Bois. You're gonna go to the dolly and glee all the sights and sounds that they have down in here in hell. Hey, Behemoth. So I hear you have some pull over what goes on down here, is that correct? Yes, indeed, bad man. I be the one them come to when them's craving something. So I need to get back to the plains of the quick to help my mom. You's not just a boy. You'll be deader than dead in blood fire. When you die, you die forever. But sure. Now look, see here, rude boy. I ain't no no be wanting I you sad. God damn, this is difficult to read and voice at the same time. <laughs> and I will give you the things you never had. Come stroll with me, Ayman. You need to find baby doll Baga Yaga. What? Where is she then? She be to the east of this place, man. She got one pimpin' pad, I and I boy, for sure. When he says east, he means right. For there are no suns, equinoxes, etc., in hell. Oh, well that makes sense. Oh, follow the cat. Follow him. Can I get out of this friggin' cacophony of fucktitude? Thank you. Alright, darling. Fancy a bit of fun? <laughs> Profoundly, no. Hey, who are you? It's not gay if you don't smile. Motherfucker. It's not gay if you pray afterwards. Fuck. I'll give you a little something that you could get at home that you can't get at home. What you say? Not in a month of blue moons. What about you? I ain't going no place. What about you? Can I talk to you? Don't be a jerk when it comes to hard work. Alright, so the clay dudes, well, I mean, they're all clay, but the clay-looking guys, they rhyme, and then the other guys talk about how it's not gay if you don't do something. That's amazing. A poster of the Knight from Night Runner. Great game. Play on Game Jolt. Shameless plug. I love it. <laughs> love to love you, baby. Yikes on a bikes. Is this ICP? No, it's a uh, friggin'... I don't even know. Love comes in various guises. Respect that. Uh. <laughs> what is all this? What's up, baby? What's up, three-headed baby? Whoa. Is he peeing blood into his mouth? I think so. But I see no penis, so there's no reason to blur this out. I see a penis. <laughs> Nick Cat. All right. There's a penis right above my head. Let's get out of here. What are you doing? 
Look at that evil little girl. The fire. Good God, this is amazing. I love it. I love it so much. Alright. Who's that guy? Is it Sasha Baron Cohen? Okay, what we got here? There may be ways if you find Baba Yagaman. She be the one naughty mother. She put a obi upon you. She'll cast a spell on you. Alright. Let's, uh, let's go this way then. Whoa. I'm just gonna chill and listen. Dude, Jack, if you... I'm, I'm assuming you sang all of these songs. You're a fucking genius. <laughs> these are awesome. I love it. Okay. So what do we got here? Can I catch one of these guys? No, I, I, I can't. Okay, what is this? Behemoth March. Okay. Down here in hell. <laughs> Anything you want, just come to me. I'm gonna have to go back and listen to this entire song because it's this is fucking amazing. The temple of something. The home of Baba Yaga. <laughs> What's up guys? How you doing? Oh god, not that guy. He gives my name a bad name. Edward something or other. Edward Sparkle or Stardust. Fucking Christ. What is this? The Temple of Sins. <laughs> God damn, Jack. This I'm gonna have to look through the, the game uh, files to find the songs, because this is amazing. Alright, let's go to Baba Yaga. This is kinda nice. I have stitched life into me like a rare organ. Yeah, save it. Okay. God damn, dude! This music is great. What's up, girl? Black cats everywhere. Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga. I am Baba Yaga, queen of the witches. Why do you darken my door? Are you another that might beseech me for my services? Miss Yaga, I need to get back to my mother dearest. Can you help me? Also, did a baby name you? I cannot help you. Not yet, at least. You must first understand your predicament, yes. You're in hell. Your hell is a personification of your life's afflictions. See Charon and cross his palm with a single coin to grant you passage to your hell's crux. Give him an ablusime for a danake. A doubloon for a guinea concealed under your tongue. Also, taketh he PayPal. Ah, oh, good, good, good. How <laughs> my I, I understand my circumstances better. Go the south to yon temple of sins. There shall you find answers. Only once your sins have been absolved shall you be granted a chance of revisiting. Pride is the greatest sin. Destroy him first. Thanks, Baba. How can I ever repay you? A kiss on the lips. Nope. Sorry. Cannot help you. Alright, so I gotta go south to the Temple of Sins. I know exactly where that is. Okay. 
I fucking love this song. It's amazing. Yeah. Hey. Oh shit. That beat, son. Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah. Let's do this. I'm in hell and I don't know what to do. Dev say in and he's got some fucking shoot. What? <laughs> I don't fucking know. Ah, you wanna fight, do you? If you ain't careful, Sonny Jim, you're gonna go home in a flipping ambulance. Okay. Even in hell, they have groups of Cretans wearing hoodies. God damn it. <laughs> okay, what else is in here? This is fucking awesome. I. Ugh, man. I don't even know what to say. Hey! Freaking Donald Trump! Get out of here with your greed, sucker. She said, uh, pride is worse. Pride is here? <laughs> you look amazing. Hey, I love your shoes and your sweater is to die for. I wish I had tastes like yours. You're so amazing compared to me. Oh, this is envy. I gotcha. Whoa. Hello. Gluttony, probably. Meh, I'm too senseless, senseless to go insane. Extreme grief may ultimately vent itself in violence, but more generally takes the form of apathy. In a universe of wonders, humans have managed to invent boredom. I'm going to just sit here for a while. Let it all pass by me. That is sloth. Whoa. Freaking gummy bottles? Yeah. So this is gluttony. What's up, dude? Oh yeah, I invented injustice and I am the current enforcer, baby. Feed me. I am part of your nature. How do I feed you? Can I take this? No? No, I cannot do nothing. All right, let's continue. Oh, hello, you just got really, really loud. Stop touching yourself, man. Look at him. What is called a reason for living is also an excellent reason for dying. Okay. Hey, lust. People wait around for too long for love. I'll let you inside me if you kill your pride. Pride will make you long for a solution to things and I don't like solutions. I let you inside me. <laughs> what the fuck is this? I'm beautiful. I have augmented my body into the definition of beauty. I am the mother of arrogance. Blah blah. You will beat pride. You will never beat pride's riddle. He refers to himself in the third person. What a twat. Vapid doesn't like that shit. Solve Bright's riddle. Press escape to exit the riddle. Space to confirm. Uh. How do I. What's the riddle? <clears throat> Is it this? Hi. What the hell are you doing? My head itch, my head itch, my head itch, my head itch! <laughs> Pardon me for being so rude, but have you any clues concerning Pride's riddle? Her second is in death, but never in death mall. Ta! Head itch! Oh, their, their heads all itch. Do you have a moment? Any clues considering? Her third is death, but never in the dirty deed. Cheers. Okay. Hey, you. Just... There we go. Sorry to bother you, but any clues considering Pride's riddle? Her first is in death, but never in health. What? I done gagged. 
probably something really, really simple. Oh, hi. Oh god, 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 oh god. Excuse beef. You wouldn't happen to have a clue for Pride's riddle, would you? Her fourth is in death. But never in head. Oh, you know what? I th Thanks, mate. <laughs> okay, so... Let's try this again. Oh, uh, do I have a piece of paper sitting around anywhere? I do. I think I get this. Third room. Whoa. Hello. I used to be beautiful. Pride ripped us all up and is using us for spare parts. My face is now a leg or something. Ah! Good to know. Really, so, uh... I feel terrible for asking you, but you got any tidbits of information concerning Bride's riddle? Yeah, sure. Her fifth is in death, but never in... T, darling. Are you fucking kidding me? What is this crap? <laughs> nice one. Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay, so... We've got... Yes. Five letters. Oh. And there's... <laughs> Only a few. Let's try... Let's try death. Fucking Christ. I didn't even need to do all that crap. That was easy. Well, all of us need to be toppled off the throne of self, my dear. Perched up on the tears of others and never upon our own cheek. Okay, so now I can... Oh, God. Really? <laughs> oh, he's gonna let... I'm just gonna say she. She's gonna let me inside of her. Okay. Enter me. Oh, God. What is that? Hi. What in tarnation are you? I'm the child you never had. I'm the future that never came to fruition. Gordon Bennett! What a frightful thing that lies in the belly of lust. So, you wanna fight? Fight me! I guess I'll fight the baby. <laughs> oh, baby emerged. Did you want baby? No. Couldn't afford to have a child anyway. I never found myself in a position where such an opportunity arose. But did you want baby? All I wanted in life was to have a child. It's just... Life kind of got in the way. Baby wanted life. Baby needs life. Look here, baby! I made an educated decision. If I had you, I would have struggled to support us. You killed baby? No, I didn't... Alright, fine. Only in words. Only in that I kill potential life when I scratch or sneeze. I didn't kill you. You were never born. Then I was never here at all? Yes. You were here. In my heart. As an aspiration of what I could be. Had I been more fortunate in my life. Then lust is defeated because within her lies the love of an unborn child. Derek's party was victorious. A shit ton of experience received. And 69 bunghole. What the hell is bunghole? Derek is now weighing 42. Sleepy fingers was learned. Pop tarts. Pop farts. <laughs> Britney Spears is now weighing 42. Double fudge. Prison felch. Massive paw. Fish slit. Oh god. Choke, 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 choke was learned. God damn. Electric jizz funk. Help me, I'm drowning in a sea of eggs. What's learned? <laughs> oh, man. This is awesome. Portfolio. There's a lot of this, though. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of this. <laughs> Milky man. Charlotte Brown candle. Fifty shades of gray. Yuck, an open manhole. Holy Christ. God damn! 
That was a lot of shit. So I can leave now, right? Right, right, right. Baby loves you. <laughs> Alright. What's up? To others, the universe seems decent because decent people have welded eyes. That is why they fear loons. They are never frightened by the crowding of a rooster, crowing of a rooster, or when strolling under a starry heaven. In general, people savor the pleasures of the flesh only on the condition that they may be insipid. Huh. Interesting. 